And time to look at business now. And uh, Mike Apple is standing by. Tesla targeting next year for a computerized drive across America. I say bring on the self-driving car. It's not coming uh, fast enough for me, Mike. Really? Yes. Really? Mike, okay. I want to go back to a five-speed. <laughs> okay. My, my, my wife is in love with her. She has a six-speed. Uh, okay. okay. I, why do we have standard cars still in this world? I'm sorry, <laughs> folks. I drive it. I can't stand doing it. We have graduated to automatics. Uh, now we're graduating to driverless cars. Okay? Yes, Kevin. I know. It, you know, it's a, it's, a lot of it has to do with safety. The, yeah. the, the prognosticators say that the autonomous vehicle will be much safer than today's automobile because you're taking the human equation out of the mix. Computers should be able to respond uh, quicker to various circumstances on the roads, if in fact they work properly. That uh, still has to be uh, effectively proven, and all the tests are underway right now. But Elon Musk, the head of Tesla, said in a conference call last night that next year they want to do a, a fully autonomous drive from New York City to Los Angeles. All of the cars that are now being shipped by Tesla have the hardware for autonomous driving. They have eight cameras instead of just one and all sorts of other bells and whistles and sensors. The software is still the sticking point. they got to get that upgraded before you've got uh, full Fully autonomous or self-driving vehicles on the road on a consistent basis but it's coming and it just depends on which automaker is going to lead the way uber of course has those vehicles uh, testing right now in pittsburgh among other places ford uh, and, and others are all working toward the age of the self-driving car and tesla shares up a little bit pre-market this morning well the the jays are out the leafs blew a four goal lead but the toronto stock market is still one of the best performers in the world for 2016. tsx comes in at a 15-month high this morning after a big jump yesterday of close to 100 points. It's up 14% year to date. And lo and behold, the price for oil right now at a close to a 15 month high. Settled at a, a peak of a year and a half yesterday, settling back just a little bit in the early trade this morning, but it's still electronic activity at this point. So wouldn't be surprised to see oil, in fact, test $52 per barrel by the end of today's trade. The dollar's down, meantime, Bank of Canada lowering economic growth forecasts. And they even talked about bringing in some stimulus at the last policy meeting. Governor Stephen Pola saying, they're worried about a few things in the market right or the economy right now. They've lowered economic expectations. And one thing that could slow things down is the recent maneuvers to cool off the Toronto and Vancouver housing markets. So again, Kev, we're going into the trading day. TSX at a 15-month high. That's not too bad. Back to you. All right. Thank you, sir.